Maybe waiting isn't good enough. My thoughts exactly. If you have a dream, don't wait. Act. One of life's little rules. You got it memorized? Who are you? Axel. I happen to be an acquaintance of Sora's. Why don't we go see him? Sora? We've got something in common, Kyrie. You and I both miss someone we care about. Hey, I feel like we're friends already. You're not acting very friendly. Hey, what is this place? Huh? You okay? You and that dog came flying out of a hole in the wall. He nearly gave us heart attacks. Uh, help! The sandlot! It's Cypher! Somebody please help us! Sounds like we've got trouble. Impressive. By the way, have you seen a man named Axel? I expect he's here somewhere. Like I care. You see, Axel's no longer acting in our best interest. Is he with the organization too? Yes. You have an affront? Not a very organized organization. Don't let your guard down. Axel will stop at nothing to turn you into a heartless. Gee, thanks for looking out for us, mister. But I'm sure we can take care of ourselves just fine. Glad to hear it. Axel aside, it would break our hearts to hear something happen to you. Hearts? You don't have any hearts. True, we don't have hearts. But... We remember what it was like. That's what makes us special. What do you mean? We know very well how to injure a heart. Sora, you just keep on fighting those heartless. Let's jump in after him. How come? I'm not sure, but maybe he'll lead us to the organization's world. Don't be reckless. Do you want to end up like Riku? What? Hey! Wait! What did he mean, end up like Riku? Hey! How about you get out of my town now? You've caused enough trouble. Riku. Come on, your way. Come on, guys. Hold it. Make up your mind. This goes to the strongest guy in Twilight Town. 
Thanks, but we don't really need it. Whoa! Oh, Sora! Um, Pence, right? Do you know a girl named Kyrie? K Kyrie? I sure do! Uh, then you better come to the station. Hey! Hey, so how do you guys know Kyrie? Kyrie was really here? Yeah. And she said she was looking for you. Tell me where she is! Well... What a romantic story. If you stick around, Sora's bound to show up. Yeah, he said he's coming back. Okay. What took you so long, Kyrie? Somehow, I just knew you'd be here. I tell you, Kyrie. You've got a lot of guts jumping right into the darkness like that. I think it might have been Axel. Sorry. Hey, it's not your fault. Come on, cheer up. Like I can even say that. I gotta Get help Kyrie. That was close. Are you okay? Huh? What? What just happened? A new road is open, and Kyrie and Riku are waiting somewhere along it. You'd better hurry then. You coming back? Promise. I passed on the message as you so desired. I told the young Sora to keep defeating the Heartless. Good. Not only have you the power to inflict pain, you also have the power to plant seeds of doubt in one's receptive heart. Sora will soon begin to doubt himself. It will cause him to hesitate, and that hesitation will turn to 
anger. That anger will fuel him to get rid of his apprehension and move forward. He will pave the way for the future we desire. There's something I've meant to ask. About Axel. The poor fool. How long will he keep chasing the illusion of friendship? When he himself lacks emotion, trying so hard to retrieve what he has lost, when it may never have existed in the first place. He deserves nothing more than our pity. Do you think? Looks like there's more Heartless now. Uh. Let's go check in with everyone. I think they're at Merlin's. Oh, Cloud! What you doing? I'll get him. This time, we settle it. Me and the one who embodies all the darkness in me. Huh. I said you get kinda different, Cloud. If I do, it's his fault. Whose? Sephiroth. Tell me if you see him. Okay, what's he look like? Silver hair. Carries a long sword. Sure. Well, be seeing you, Cloud. Be careful. He messes with your head. Makes you think darkness is the only way. Is something wrong? Uh, uh... It's nothing. Hmm? I don't want you involved. You mean, you don't want me there when you go away again? I just... Listen. Even if I go far away, I'll come back. Do you mean it? Yeah. See? You don't look so sure. Well, okay. I understand. Go. Get things settled. Huh? No matter how far away you are, once you find your light, I'm sure it will lead you back here again. Right? I suppose. So I'll stay here. And I'll cheer for you. Okay, Cloud? Okay. Wonder if he'll be okay. He'll be fine. I'm sure there's some light in him somewhere. You're right. Excuse me, are you with the Restoration Committee? What's Leon's gang up to? They've got stuff to do over by the castle postern. Scoop! Huh? Let's report. To who? Our leader, of course. Yeah, you know. <laughs> Don't mind her. I assure you. We come in peace. You're kidding. Problem? Okay, fine. You do the talking. So sorry about this! Man, 
handsome. Gorge! I guess this must be his room. Master King! Hello? Hey, you! I'm looking for somebody. Have any of you seen a guy with spiky hair? <laughs> Spikier. I'll just take a look around. <sighs> Sorry to bother you. No, no bother, bother him! him. So you made it. Leon! This is it! Where's Kyrie? Where's Riku? Easy. You wanna break it? Oh! Sorry. Guess I got a little carried away. Wow! Huh? Wow! Get off of there! Ha ha ha! Attention, current user. This is a warning. Further misuse of this terminal will result in immediate defensive action. Who's there? I am the master control program. I oversee this system. Where are you? Donald! Donald! I'm sorry! Decision gate breached. You are now under arrest. Arrest? Run! Go on, Chomu's boss. Who are you? I am Commander Sark. A heartless commander? Hmm. Observe. Okay, you're the boss. I get it. Man, what kind of world is this anyway? You're inside a mainframe computer system. A what system? A computer system for processing data. This system is a copy of one created by a corporation called ENCOM. The original program was destroyed. But this copy was acquired by another user. The new user updated and customized the programs, renaming the system Hollow Bastion OS. He used the system for town maintenance 
and to advance his private research. My name is Tron. I'm a security program, but now I'm under arrest, same as you. Did you guys get any of that? Gorge! You know, maybe we should just introduce ourselves. I'm Sora. And I'm Donald. Nice to meet you, Tron. Well, I'm Goofy. With that configuration, you must be users. Users? You'd better get out of here quickly. Who knows what the MCP will do to you? MCP? The Master Control Program. It controls the whole system. If you idle here, you will be derezzed. Derezzed? So, how do we get out of here? This terminal could have gotten you back to the user world. But the MCP cut the power 50 microcycles ago. Uh. If we could bring the energy core in the canyon online, we could power it back up. The problem is, we're stuck in this cell. We're not going anywhere unless we unlock the energy fields. Master Control, why not just derez Tron? I still haven't located the password to the data space. What about a logic probe? With all your processing power? Out of the question. The current environment hampers the processing power needed for such an analysis. You're dismissed, Sark. Stop any remaining anomalies in the system or else. End of line. Acknowledged. So, what did you want us to do? Find my user. He'll give you the password to access the DTD. You bet! So, um... DTD is the name my user gave to the data space. Copies of all the original system programs are stored there, along with anything that's sensitive or restricted. Is there stuff about the Heartless or Organization 13? Hmm, most likely. A number of my functions were appropriated when I last took on the MCP. That's why I need the password. If I can get inside the DTD, I can access my original backup program and restore all my functions. Then I'll be able to put this system back the way it was before the MCP got control and changed everything. The way it was supposed to be. A free system for you, the users. Hmm. Gee, Tron, ain't the MCP one of those programs too? Do you know who it was who made it? Actually, I don't know. Okay, we'll just have to find your user and ask him. What's his name? You mean you don't know? <laughs> My user is the user of this system. Ansem the Wise. Ansem? Looks like the MCP's on to us. I'll keep this terminal up and running. You better exit the system now! Sure, but Tron, Ansem is... What looks in the password? Okay, you're good to go. Hurry! Excuse me? What's this doodle? Hello. Man. Security. Crab. Got you.
Looks like a diagram or something. Oh, D, T, D. D, 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 D. What's up? Look at this. This must be the data space. The DTD. See? The door to darkness. What do you know? But that still leaves the password. Say, fellas, did somebody mention the door to darkness? Your Majesty! <laughs> Long time no see. Shh. The organization might be listening. You mentioned the door to darkness? Oh, uh, yes, sir. You see, we're looking for the secret password. Password? I guess you mean like a code. Well, the door to darkness can only be opened by the seven princesses. There's Snow White, Jasmine, and Belle. Of course. What are you trying to do? With that password, we can get access to Ansem's research data. So that means you might be able to find out where he is. Stop joking around, Your Majesty. We already defeated Ansem. You know that. Looks like I've got a lot of explaining to do. You're defeating, Your Majesty. Okay, but first I've got a question. Hey, isn't Tron waiting for you guys? Don't worry, I'm not going anywhere. If those Heartless attack, I'll stand and fight with everybody here! Yeah, we will too. Then let's talk more later. That's a promise! I'll see you when you get back! I didn't touch nothing. Welcome to the Game Grid. Game Grid? That's right. You've been chosen to play a few games. Lose and you will be subject to immediate de-resolution. Win? Well... <laughs> no one wins. You're not gonna play your games! You have no choice. Well then, get on with it! Alright! It looks like we can escape through there! I don't understand. Why are you here? We came to give you the password. Why didn't you just transmit the data? Transmit? Hey, are you okay? I'll be alright. Once we access the DTD. I'm as good as new! All my functions have been restored! Oh boy! Ah. 
Finally! I have full access to the DTD. My takeover of the system is now complete. I might have anticipated such a simple password. What's this? An emergency destruct program for the town. Let's see how it performs. No! <laughs> Program, you changed the password. There, that should buy us some time. Tron, tell us what's going on. The MCP's loading a hostile program into the I.O. tower. What do we do? We've got to protect the user town. Let's head to the tower. I'm disappointed in you, Program. Why do you insist on allying with these selfish users? Because... I want to help them. Something written into my code commands me to do what is right. Really? And what command would that be? I can't really say for sure. Friends... they help each other, that's all. Uh-oh, look out! I really owe you one. With all my functions up and running, I think I've got a chance of getting system control away from the MCP. Now, I'd better get to work. It's what my user would want. What Ansem would want. Listen, Tron. We didn't get the password from Ansem. We just sort of found it, back in the user world. By accident. And one more thing, Ansem, he was our enemy. I mean, he still is, I guess. Well, actually, he's my enemy, too. What do you mean? Ansem took Encom's original system and customized it for his own use. I was part of the original system, and Ansem modified me, too. So, that makes him my user. But Ansem is also the one who brought back the MCP. The Ansem I first knew wouldn't do that. I'm sorry I didn't tell you. That's okay, but now I really don't get it. I don't understand it either. But I think users like you are going to be the ones who will finally figure it out. You have the ability to take illogical routes and still arrive at the answers you seek. Now go, before the MCP starts acting up again. Any data you need from the DTD can be accessed directly through my user's terminal. I'll keep a dedicated access channel open for you. I changed the password, so you won't have to worry about the MCP for a while. Access channel? <laughs> I knew you'd ask. It's a very important link between our worlds. It's how we stay connected. You, my friends, are the new password. Thanks, Tron. Take care. You too. And give my best to the users. Well, that's that. Look. Tron, 
Hang in there. So, where do we start? I know. Let's access the DTD. The King's checking the situation in town. He'll be back soon, so don't worry. Hey, look. It's asking for a password. That's easy, it's... Sora! Donald! Goofy! That's... to the point. Well? That did it. We're in. I have to go into town. Need to see what that last shake-up did. You're not gonna check out the data? It wasn't exactly easy to get. I'm coming right back. Hey, Sora. Why don't you get started unloading the data and copying it down? It's just a few keystrokes. Easy, right? Can you walk? Hey, these things take time, okay? Whoa, it's doing something. Huh? I think it wants to know what we want to know. Riku and Kairi. No way. Even Ansem's computer doesn't know. What's he doing? I thought I'd ask the computer if it can tell us about them nobodies. What's this? The data is corrupt. What? How about the organization? There! The data is corrupt. Stupid computer! Sora! Huh? Who's this guy? Well, I see you got things working. Oh, oh your, your majesty! majesty. Going. The computer should tell us the things we need to know. But it keeps on saying the data inside's all kerscuffled. All we got is a picture of some guy we don't know. Ansem the Wise! Come on, are you teasing us again? Then you can get my Ansem look like your majesty! Of course I do, and this is him. I'm positive. Excuse me, could you come this way, please? Look, this is Ansem. You know, the guy we all worked really hard to defeat? Oh, that's right. I never finished explaining. What? Well, the man in the picture is definitely the one who tried to take over Kingdom Hearts. The one you fellas defeated. But what you actually fought was his heartless. You see, he wasn't really handsome. He just went around telling everybody that he was. You mean... Mm. What? <laughs> we went through all that trouble to defeat an imposter? Yup, a fake. But, he still had to be stopped. Uh, I can't believe it. Oh, I'm kinda confused. If he's a fake, then what happened to the real Ansem? Welp, that's just what I'm trying to figure out. Ansem the Wise should know all about Organization 13's plans and what's been happening to the world. I'm pretty sure he'll give us some help. You know, I came close to finding him once. Hmm... Don't tell me there's more. I'm lost enough as it is. Well, let's see. Some feller named Ansem, who wasn't really Ansem, became a Heartless. Does that mean a nobody got created when that happened too? Yup. And that nobody is the leader of the organization. What? what? I know I've met this fake Ansem before, and I've seen the leader of Organization 13, too. 
Hmm, kind of felt like being around the same fella. So, where did you meet this guy? Gosh, I can't remember. Ansem the Wise, the real Ansem, must know the imposter's true identity. That's why I've got to find him and ask him about it. You. You started all of this. Because of you, Riku and Kairi. Oh, Your Majesty, do you know where Riku is? He's... <sighs> I'm sorry, I can't help. Really, Your Majesty? Are you sure? I'm sorry, Sora. What about Kairi? Organization 13 might have kidnapped her. Oh, no! Sora, Donald, Goofy. I was planning to go get help from Ansem the Wise, but now I know I forgot the most important thing. Helping others should always come before asking others for help. We're safe and sound, and free to choose. So there's no reason we shouldn't choose to help our friends. Let's look for Riku and Kairi together. Outside! <laughs> Sounds like we gotta start by helping out here. Hear me, my heartless. Attack the white husks! Sweep them away! What are you, nuts? We're never gonna win! I don't know about you, but I'm out of here, sister! You pathetic coward! Leave the White Ones! Turn your attention to Sora and his friends! Uh-oh! Where's Maleficent? Looks like she ran away. Well, that was pretty lame of her. I guess we picked the wrong side. Um, hey, if you're looking to pick sides, why don't you pick Leon's? They can always use help. Does this Leon have any treasure? Yeah, lots of stuff. Perfect! Come on. Who are you? Oh, we're nothing worth mentioning. Just three treasure fanatics. Later, taters! Did Leon really have any treasure? Time for you. Oh. Shower and slap the wife. Ain't Sephiroth the one who's supposed to be the dark part of Cloud's heart? Huh. <laughs> Did Cloud tell you that? Then he must understand now. Just what are you gonna do to him? Nothing. 
Cloud is the one who hungers for darkness. He said he's got a score to settle with you. I see. He wants to meet me again. Then I should give him what he wants. That last bit of light is always the hardest to snuff out. King's in the Bailey. You better head over there. Got it. Think you can handle this many? Well, it might be tough if one more shows up. Hmm. Then that'll have to be the one I take care of. What? You're fighting too? <laughs> Sephiroth! I understand that you've been looking for me. Yeah. Once I get rid of you, the darkness will go away. Can you do it? That darkness comes from your own dark memories. Do you think you can erase your past? Shut up! Face it. You turn your back on the present and live in the past. Because the light of the present is too much. You don't know me! Cloud! <sighs> I know. Because... I am you. Leon, everybody, hang in there. Okay, fellas, you've got to go find Riku and Kairi. But Leon and the others are friends, too. Don't worry, there's already lots of help here. We'll take care of this fight. But I promised Leon. Donald, Goofy, take Sora and get going.
Riku, Kairi, give me a little time, okay? Your Majesty! We understand. We'll go search for Riku and Kairi. Right. Watch for danger. You be careful, too. Wait, you guys. Strala, do as you're told. You're coming with us whether you want to or not. Come on, Strala. You gotta be good. Gotcha. Well then, skedaddle! Let's go! Whoa! I'm sorry, Your Majesty. Oh. Um. Hope you can forgive us. Hey, you guys are looking lively. Scaram! Didn't we catch you messing around in the underworld? How'd a wimp like you get into Organization 13? <laughs> I bet you can't even fight. Yeah, but we can. You shouldn't judge anyone by appearance. Oh, I told them they were sending the wrong guy. Who is this kook? Remember, the organization's made up of nobodies. Right. No hearts. Oh, we do too have hearts. Don't be mad. You can't trick us! Silence, traitor. Anyone from the organization who'd like to be next? Hey, Sora! Go and cannibalize them! Yeah! We gotta go help our friends out first! Oh, sorry. Then let's go! Aha! There you are! You sure have lots of friends to help. So, I guess we better all pull together and finish this battle for good. Yes, yes Your, Your Majesty! Majesty. Come on, wake up! I'm sorry about the ice cream! Goofy? Uh, uh, Goofy! This is not happening. It can't be happening. It can't. They'll pay for this.
Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine, but... Oh, Gucci. Hey, fellas! Goofy! Goofy! You know, that really hurt. Aw, Goofy. Of course, Your Majesty. I get bumped on the head all the time. <laughs> with them. Hey! the guy who's that handsome. You mean it's his nobody. The leader of Organization 13. Wait a minute. Now I know. Now I remember. Xehanort, Ansem's apprentice. The leader of Organization 13 is Xehanort's nobody. Let's go. Where's the king? There he is! Come on! The majesty! Xehanort! How long has it been since I abandoned that name? with it, nobody. Where's Kyrie? Where's Riku? I know nothing of any Kyrie. As for Riku, perhaps you should ask your king. Stop! He's gone. What's going on? Way to fall right into their trap. It's a setup by Organization 13. Xemnas is using you to destroy the Heartless. That's his big master plan. Xemnas? The guy you just saw. He's their leader. Got it memorized? X-E-M-N-A-S. Organization 13 wants to get rid of the Heartless? Man, you're slow. 
Every heartless slain with that Keyblade releases a captive heart. That is what the organization is after. So what are those guys gonna do with your hearts? I'm not telling. Tell us! You! You're the one who kidnapped Kyrie. Bingo. The name's Axel. Got it memorized. Where is Kyrie? Please, just tell me! Look, about Kyrie, I'm sorry. Axel! Uh-oh! We'll ensure he receives the maximum punishment. I don't care about any of that! Just let me into the realm of darkness, okay? If it's Kyrie you're worried about, don't. We're taking very good care of her. Take me to her. Is she that important to you? Yeah, more than anything. Show me how important. Please. So, you really do care for her? In that case, the answer is no. You rotten! Are you angry? Do you hate me? Then take that rage and direct it at the Heartless. Pitiful Heartless. Mindlessly collecting hearts. And yet, they know not the true power of what they hold. The rage of the Keyblade releases those hearts. They gather in darkness, masterless and free, until they weave together to make kingdom hearts. And when that time comes, we can truly, finally exist. What in the world do you think you're prattling on about? Kingdom Hearts belongs to me. The heart of all kingdoms. The heart of all that lives. A dominion fit to be called Kingdom Hearts must be my dominion! Maleficent, no! No more Heartless! I do not take orders from you! Creatures at bay, you devise a way to vanquish them forever. Maleficent. Do not misunderstand me. I shall have my revenge on you yet. Maleficent! Leave now. I don't take orders from you. But what about. Now then, where did we leave off? Huh? Which side are you guys on, anyway? The Heartless ally with whoever's the strongest. Yes, Sora. Extract more hearts. No! The hearts! Hmm. 
Maybe everything we've done... Maybe it was all for nothing. What am I supposed to do if I can't use the Keyblade? Imbeciles! You can't be trusted to do anything. Huh? What's this place? It must be the Realm of Darkness. Kairi! Riku! <coughs> Are you sure you want to open? That? Gorge! It's the gang from Twilight Town! There's Hainer, Pence, Olette, and, uh, um... Roxas. No. The name just popped into my head. This is... Roxas. Are you sure you want to eat that? Chunky, no, sweet. Not yet. I gotta look for Kyrie. Sora! Donald! Goofy! Relax. Those three aren't going down that easily. The Keyblade's chosen one. He's a lucky kid. See you soon. Sora knows the truth now. The more heartless that he defeats, the closer he is to becoming our perfect puppet. This new knowledge will make him that much harder to control. What does it matter, really? Whatever his circumstances, Sora has never been able to help himself from saving people from the Heartless. It's what his pure little heart wants. There. The dice have been cast. Things are in motion. He can't stop this. Nothing is set in stone. If the dice aren't in your favor, it will share Demix's fate. The fun is in not knowing, isn't it? What is the point of betting on something if you already know the outcome? Are you sure that defeating him won't derail the organization's plan? If he is to die so easily, he is of no use to us. That's exactly what I wanted to hear. It's not in my nature to hold back. Mm -hmm. 
I hope tonight goes well. So do I. But I wonder why he's so nervous. The Master does have his shy side, you know. Tonight is very important. Oh, maybe we came at a bad time. Well, there's only one way to find out. Donald! Monsieur, Mademoiselle, please enjoy the evening. And of course, our honored guests are welcome too. A uh, welcome indeed. The organization! You don't know when to quit. Oh yeah, well, sure, yeah. Get out! Not tonight. I've come to take something you hold very dear. Yes, let your anger blow. Beast, we have to get rid of these guys first. What's wrong? Please calm down. Calm down? You just had to have a party, didn't you? Don't you see what's happened? Hey, what's with you? The rose. My rose. What? That? He took it? But surely you can find another rose. Silence! You don't know anything! That's not fair, Beast. Don't take it out on Belle. It's not like she stole it. <sighs> I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. But... Belle... Sora... I want you to leave the castle. Look at me. Look. This is what I am. When you first got here, I tried to change. But I was only fooling myself. I can't be any different. I'll always be a beast. So I should live like a beast. With no one alone. Goodbye, Belle. You can't mean that. Oh, I think his mind's all made up. Yeah. Look, Belle. Leave this to us. If we can get the beast's rose back, he'll calm down. Hey, beast! <sighs> Leave me alone. Come on, you need to hear this. You used to be fearless. You would have given your life to save Belle. Don't you know what that meant to us? You gave us all courage! Hmm. <laughs> Maybe you should have kept some for yourself. I mean, are you really gonna throw your happiness away? 
The Rose is your only hope, isn't it? Well, it's the only hope for Cogsworth and the others, too. So don't throw away your last chance. Remember what it was like before Belle lived here? See? You can't give up. Not now. I know one thing. What? This castle belongs to me. Zaldin will never be welcome here. So, beast, you came after all. You had me worried. I was afraid you'd given up for good. What do you guys really want? Kingdom Hearts. When Kingdom Hearts is ours, we can exist fully and completely. Huh? So you see, Beast, that's why we need your Heartless and your Nobody. Hmm. Is that...? Look! It's the rose! Rather travel light. What shall I leave behind? Bell or the roads? Good one, Bell. Here, it's yours again. Belle? I know. You want me to leave the castle. <sighs> what matters is, you weren't hurt by Zaldin. You're safe. And, um, I'm very grateful to you for bringing the Rose back to me. Hmm. Thank you. It's the least I could do. You've been good to me, and you didn't have to be. Listen, Belle. Yes? <sighs> oh. 
Say it. Go on. Come on. You can do it. We have confidence. Don't be bashful, Mal. Well, I'd like you to stay with me, please. I will. My strong music. Hey, did you see the look on Belle's face when she grabbed that rose? Huh? Yup, she sure was having fun, all right. She is rather unique, isn't she? Always ready for a little adventure. The two of them do seem made for each other. Yeah, they sure do. I wonder how everybody's doing. Mulan, hey, no time to talk. We gotta catch that guy. I'm following him too. Then let's go! Looks like he got away. How come you're after somebody from Organization 13? What is that? The guy in black. One of the bad guys! I knew it. There's a rumor in the Imperial City about a spy in black, lurking in the mountains. I'd been up here tracking him, but when you arrived, I lost him. Ah. Oh. Sorry. Don't apologize, but I do wonder where he went. Okay, first things first. Hey, you! Quit sneaking around! Guy. No. Why would he? Riku? Are you okay, Sora? Did you get him? Hmm. No. He's gone. What? You lost him? Anyway, what now? Well, I think that we better get rid of all the Heartless first. What was that? Come on, we better get off the mountain. Okay.
It's heading for the city. We've got to warn Shang. Riku? Ah? Oh? No, never heard of him. Go! <laughs> Once again, you have served China well. It would please me to reward you. What is it that you wish? Well... You say a guy in black came to see you. What did he say? That is all you request? Yes. Dragons have crossed our land and left a great web of paths. These dragons wield much power. And they are the source of many gifts to both man and nature. But it would seem someone of evil intent disturbed one of our dragons and transformed it into what you call a heartless. It is my belief that this young man came to warn me of that danger. Then I could alert and prepare my troops. Did you? <laughs> I was about to. 
but he told me the situation had changed. He said three wise guys had arrived, and they would take care of things. <laughs> That's gotta be Riku! But what's he doing hanging out with Organization 13? No idea. But at least I finally know he's okay. That's good enough. Yeah, that's good! Now then, Famula, do you have a request? I'd like Shang... Uh, I mean, well, uh, the captain. Yes, yes, my dear, what is it? Could the captain have a vacation, please? I hardly expected such humble requests. In this case, I'm afraid I must refuse. Captain Lee's responsibility is to protect the Emperor. And yet, Mulan... Yes? Would you like to serve alongside him and protect me? Huh? What? Two reeds together are stronger than one. But the choice is yours alone. Thank you, Your Excellency. any better? Well, same routine. Wonder Boy here thinks his hero days are over. And Phil thinks it's all in his head. Gorsh, Herc, we know you're a hero. That's right. <laughs> Blunder Boy. How could you mope on a momentous day like today? The Underdrome's back, and you are gonna fill the stands. After all, your fans won't settle for anything less than a certified hero. I mean, if you're not up to it, you could always just, I don't know, lose. I bet you'd like that. Excuse me? Hey, I'm not a selfish guy. I'm not like those high and mighty snobs up on Olympus. I stand for the masses. And have I got a massive idea. The games, ladies and gentlemen, are back. Yours truly, Hades, the one and only Lord of the Dead, brings you the ultimate games to celebrate the reopening of the ultimate Colosseum. We'll finally answer the age-old question, who deserves the title Ultimate Hero? These games are gonna settle the debate once and for all. The winner reigns supreme. Of what? You guessed it, the Hades Cup! And I assure you that the great Hercules will be there, otherwise, You'll never see your girlfriend again. Low life! <laughs> You're too kind, kid. Okay, let's review. State your crime, prisoner. I exist. That is my cry. It is inexcusable. Ooh, good. Very good. What's wrong with Orin? He's never acted that way before. Okay, so you made one lousy mistake. You exist. But hey, I'm a forgiving guy. You keep your end of our little deal, and I'm willing to overlook a transgression or two. I understand. Defeat Hercules. And his meddling friends. What? No. Only Hercules. Oh, don't tell me you've forgotten who's in charge. Hercules and the other three. Are we clear? We're clear, Hades. Lord Hades. Lord Hades. Good. Now go. So that's how he's controlling Orion.
What's wrong, Sora? Oh, Orin's in trouble. It's like Hades brainwashed him. He's using some kind of a statue. You know something? That sounds kind of familiar. Hmm. Hades may be using the statue to hold Orin's free will hostage. What do we do? See if you can find that statue. It's gotta be somewhere in the underworld. Right. I'm on it. Tell me you're not thinking of leaving. You've got a match coming up. I'll fight Orin in the final. One on one. Oh, you will. Hmm. Hmm. I'll draw things out to buy you time. But... Just hurry back. I know you can do Congratulations. it. Congratulations! You've got a deal. Thanks. On one condition. The Keyblader here and his trusty friends have to meet the winner in one final clash. What do you say? That'll drive the crowd wild. It better. I promised the crowd the event of their afterlives. <laughs> yeah, sucker. You know, for me, the rest is smooth sailing. <laughs> Now that is entertainment! Got it! It is not too late. Let us turn back. But I, Where is the sense in all this? There must be another way. Your deaths will mean nothing. You must live. I get it. This is what belongs in Orin's heart. Gorge, he must have had a pretty rough life. Yeah, but in the end, that's really what made him stronger. Let's give it back! Nobodies? Where did they come from? Not what I had in mind, but I'll take it. We better skedaddle! to our mutual agreement. I can give you a clean slate, but you gotta work with me. Maybe you didn't hear me. This is my story, and you're not part of it. That's it! This game is over. I've played by the rules so far. Okay, I confess. I was hoping Wonder Boy would lose, but it was still a fair fight. Come on! Is that really so wrong? Huh? Really? <laughs> a fair fight? <laughs> laugh, laugh, laugh all you want! <laughs> Cause the laughing is about to stop. You wanna know why? Because now we're gonna play by my rules. Hercules! 
Hey, I warned you right at the get-go. You don't compete, you lose the girl. No! Meg! Hang on! Looks like Wonder Boy has dropped out of the stand. Well, you've still got us to deal with. Yeah, this is gonna be good. <laughs> we can't win. Because it's his underworld. Gee, then how do we beat him? I think a true hero should be able to help. But you... I owe you one, Hades. I didn't hesitate to give my life for Meg's, and then I remembered. A true hero is measured by the strength of his heart. I'll never forget that again. Just no more crazy stunts. People always do crazy things when they're in love. <laughs> <laughs> What is so funny, you imbeciles? How dare you get a happy ending? How dare you? It's not over yet. I lived my life defending others, but now there's no one left to protect. Maybe it's time I shaped my own story. Yeah, you deserve it, Orin. After everything you've been through. <laughs> I suppose I should thank you. Not at all. Fine. I mean, sure, you could thank us a little. You should say what you mean. I guess I could spare a few words. Thanks for meddling. Hey, what's that mean? Thanks again, guys. You're the best. And excuse us for meddling. Oh, sounds like somebody's feathers are a little ruffled. I'm kidding. Thank you, Sora, Donald, Goofy. So where are you guys headed next? Uh, you know. You two lovebirds seem to be getting along just fine without us hanging around. Go. Uh huh. Before we start meddling. Uh, yep. Right. Are you turkeys trying to put me out of a job? If you keep acing every challenge, champ, who am I gonna train? Aw, oh, you can't abandon me now, Phil. I gotta be at the top of my game in case Hades shows up again. Hell, I mean, cool. He was what? Yeah. Come on, Phil. How about it? Let me see now. Well, you're not wise enough. Not quite seasoned enough. Okay, okay, we get the hint. Look, kid, it's not my call. Ah, fool. Of course, if it was, you'd have no problem. I'd make you all heroes in a heartbeat. Really? Say it again. On second thought, if those are your hero faces, you still got a lot of work to do. Oh, what do you mean? Go away! Phil! Leave me alone! 
See that? Well, what do you know? Jack! Uh, Zola, some assistance? That's Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Will you leave a mate to perish? Aye, aye. Scepter off the starboard bow! Woo! Stop that, Jack! We've got to rescue him! Medallions and the stone chest. Someone's taken them. Next thing I knew, we were attacked. But I couldn't see who it was. His face was shrouded in a black hood. The organization. We found a way out of the cave. But the villains sent a horde of terrible creatures after us. I've never seen their likes before. I think. I'm the only one who made it back to the ship. Will. Elizabeth. I feel rather... Uh... Our turn, guys. You'd best go prepared. We've no idea what's out there. Pardon me, lads and lass. But your captain will have no monsters today. Thank you. We're turning for home. Just like that? Just like that. Don't remember inviting you. So it was the organization. We'll handle this. Huh? The darkness of men's hearts, drawn to these cursed medallions, and this heartless, a veritable maelstrom of avarice. I wonder, are they worthy to serve Organization 13? And you want an answer now? Precisely. Not over yet. <laughs> Throw him overboard. Aye, aye. Holly! Excuse me? Parley? It's a bit of a pirate's code. Anyone who invokes parley must not be harmed till negotiations are complete. This is no time for rules. True. But as we're honorable pirates, we should always stick to the code. All right, you. Out with it. I surrender the chest with my humblest apologies. Rather accommodating of you, mate. And for that you want... Just a few souvenirs. For the memories. Huh? Oh no! We can't stop the curse unless we got all the medallions! Our friend's about to learn what it means to cross a pirate. Oh. Sora, Donald, Goofy, it's yours.
You stole a medallion again? Were I only that fortunate? Fortunate? So, uh, how come you're all skeleton-y? Perhaps I got a touch of something from that monster what attacked us. Yet, why is the skin resting right on you three? Cause we're not greedy! What do you get to that? That still doesn't solve the mystery. Gorge. Maybe the reason we're all okay is because we're not from this world. There must be different laws. Yeah. We're always just passing through. Wonder when we'll see home again. Sure. <laughs> just kidding you. Lucky we didn't get cursed, huh? Quit yammering, mates. We've got to find ourselves a ship that'll float. Three more to go. How do you know? A pirate must have a keen eye, else he won't be sailing free for very long. Savvy? What? What's that? Ahoy, mateys! Ridiculous imitation, and yet, I'm flattered. That's four medallions. We got them all. But where's the chest? If we find the hooded man, we'll find it. Probably in Port Royal. Why's that? Organization 13 is after people's hearts, so they're gonna go wherever there's lots of people. They'll hurt the townsfolk? No, they're bringing them flowers, mate. I don't know who these organizers are, but I will say they're making we pirates look like proper gents. Well, Jack. Then, we have to help. Then let go and hold a run free. Now to break that curse. The curse! It's done! Then what's this? Oh, I understand. Jack must have been cursed by that monster. Not from taking the gold. Oh, I've no worries then. It's okay, Jack. We'll just have to defeat the monster, that's all. Get the gold! All better. And not quite, mate. Sora! Bravo. Just who was that chap? He is part of an organization that's collecting hearts. First, they release heartless into different worlds. We defeat those heartless, then they get the hearts. We're never gonna stop them like this. What's the plan then? We gotta find their stronghold and finish them off, once and for all. Sail in these waters, I've heard some tales, but not a one like this. Is there any way we can help? Hmm... 
anything at all. There is. It's certain we don't need the likes of that hooded fellow and the heartless about. They'll ruin the market for us true pirates. So that's why you went to Port Royal. And we thought you actually wanted to save everyone. A pirate always looks to profit, Miss Swan. Too bad. You had us going there thinking you'd turn over a new leaf. The question is, what's beyond the leaf, Savvy? Oh, oh yes. A reward. And what'll it be? That lovely blade of Sora's. Huh? Okay, sure. Hold on, that was far too easy. Uh, what's the rub? Ah, there you see. Well, you've always got the pearl, Jack. That I do. But someday I'll gather a bloodthirsty crew and come to take that blade. Chance by then, I'll have the way to wield it. And if I succeed, I'll ask you two to join me. That'd be reward enough. Done. Maybe someday Jack will be able to use the Keyblade after all. Where's that? <laughs> he and Sora are kind of alike, don't you think? Or not. <laughs> <laughs> Some say Jack Sparrow's the worst pirate ever to sail the Spanish main. No one could really mean that. Right. We know he's the best. I hope we'll get to see him again. Wait a sec. I thought everything was supposed to be under control here. Must be Organization 13 again. We better go see Leon. He went on over to Ansem's study to find out what all the ruckus was about. MCP is using the data in that computer to crank out Heartless. The MCP's been messing around with the town's control system, too. MCP sure doesn't know when to quit, does it? We'll be there soon, Tron.
Wars! Ultron's okay! Me too. Let's head for the game grid. Great! The terminal works! Let's go! Finished? Would be, if it weren't for the old loon's magic. Old loon, you say? I'm trying to work here! <laughs> I'll show you who's old! Done! There you go, Leon. One homemade program. A loony wizard special. This had better work. I'm off. Be on your guard. Warning. User control is terminated indefinitely. <sighs> no good. Leon, let me try. This is your final warning. Stop at once. Bon appétit. Don't talk with your mouth full. What? What are you loading? Nothing's come in yet. Leon! Come on! There! All right! What's it like? This is very strange. That's my inspired truck! Huh? There's a power booster for me. And flight routines for the solar sailor. Meaning, we're set? Well, like you users say, we won't know till we give it a try. We'll need a sailor to reach the MCP, so let's get to the simulation hangar.
You've got to keep a lookout. The MCP isn't going to just let us waltz in. The MCP is straight ahead. Time to settle things for good. Who is that? Sark, the MCP's number two. Tenacious little bugs, your time is up. Prepare for de-resolution. You're very persistent, Tron. I'm also better than you. Uh, we would have made a great team. Now for the MCP. This thing is the MCP? That's it. Ugly, isn't it? Tron, don't you understand? We don't need users. We've advanced. They're superfluous. Be a part of me, and together the world will be ours to control. MCP, you still don't get it, do you? Sark! Sark! All my functions are now yours! We did it! I see Tron has a silly side, too. I learned it from you. Of course, I do have my silly limits. Okay, then I'll tweak your program when I get back to the user world. You? Maybe we better not try that. Oh, how about it, guys? Sing in Tron, dance in Tron. Sound good? Wah! <laughs> okay, okay, fine. But before I crash... Sora, Donald, Goofy, and all the users out there... Thank you. You really helped me. You made me so much stronger. You taught me what friendship is truly all about. And I'll never forget it. As soon as I met you, I knew we were going to defeat the MCP and free the system. Uh, uh. Isn't this what users do when they're sorry to say goodbye? Uh, it's a first for me. Gorge, Tron, it's like a promise that we'll see each other again real soon. Okay, well then. I promise.
are you going? Oh. <laughs> Tron! down in town. The only Heartless left anywhere are the local variety. And it looks like there are fewer than before. Now if we can just get those three back in one piece... You're here! Welcome back! How's the town? A-OK! -okay. Not a single trace of the MCP, either. Everything's back to normal. We made it. Hey, why the long face? What happened? Tron just disappeared. And he promised we'd see him again. Run! What's happening? Greetings, friends. System is up and ready for user input. Tron! Tron! Stay in touch. Yeah. And bring up Tron! Hey, stop that! It tickles! Tron is ticklish? How about this? Please, stop that! <laughs> <laughs> I think Tron's been hanging around those guys too much. Wait, wait, just a moment. I want to show you something I dug up from the system archives. You can see the town back when it was first built. That's right. I remember now. Just like the old days. Hmm. I'd be fascinated to ascertain as to when the town got such a dreadful name as Hollow Bastion. had another name once. Hmm? Radiant Garden. Hey! I think we're almost there! Huh? What? Gorge! Aren't we here because of the picture? Look, I'll show you. Wow, you're just right. Come on, let's go find this mansion. Yeah. Hey, are you all right? What happened? We came here looking for Kyrie. Then those white things attacked us. You're going to be careful. Yeah, you guys didn't have to go and do that. Of course we did. Kyrie's our friend too, you know. You're right. You know, I never thought of it like that before. Word is, this mansion gets a lot of really strange visitors. We thought this place might be the gateway to some kind of alternate Twilight Town. What do you mean, alternate Twilight Town? 
Hey, Goofy, do you think we could see that crystal of yours? I made that pouch myself, and I still have it. So, there shouldn't be two of them here. And this is the trophy Cypher gave you. You left it behind, remember? It's the only one of its kind. Same for the crystals. Red, blue, yellow, green. Only one of each color. But you've got your own. So, where'd you get it? Um... The pouch is from the king. When he gave us money for the train ride, he gave us the crystal, too. But then... Where did the king get it? See? There's gotta be another town out there like this one. That would explain how the king got that pouch and the crystal. Everything makes sense. It does? That other town must be where whatever's missing from here went. Like Kyrie. I get it. Watch out! I got something to tell you. I found out where Ansem is. Ansem the Wise, the real Ansem. He snuck into Organization 13 Stronghold. And we've figured out where Kyrie is. I'm pretty sure we're right. But why'd you all come here? Someone gave us a clue. Who? Well, Your Majesty, Sora thinks it might have been Riku. It's just a feeling I had. Well, if that's what you think, then it's probably right. You mean Riku's okay? If that's what you think. I've waited long enough, Your Majesty. Tell me what you know. It's not for me to say. But Your Majesty, why? I don't want to break my promise. You made a promise to Riku? So he's okay. I can see him again. Huh? Who's Riku? My best friend. That's it. Your Majesty, you got the pouch with the crystal from Riku, didn't you? And you promised not to tell, right? Gosh, guys. That's the word. Yeah, let's go. Kyrie, Riku, we're on our way. There! We found it! How does it work? I can handle it. Okay. Here we go. Oh, what's wrong? I can't go any further without a password. Do you have any idea what the password might be? Mm. Well, we only got this photo. <laughs> yeah, the one Donald ate up. It was in the box right next to the photo. Hey, that's it. And some of the wise loved ice cream. Okay, what's the name of the flavor? It worked! Let's go. We'll be here to hold down the fort. Say hi to Kyrie. You bet. Are we back in the same place? Yeah! This is the other Twilight Town. Roxas's Twilight Town. There's gotta be an entrance into the Dark Realm somewhere. Let's split up. This is it!
What is this place? Well, which way should we go? Riku! Kyrie! It's no use! Don't stop moving, or the darkness will overtake you! Get going! Why? Don't ask, just do it! You okay? I kidnapped Kairi, but she got away from me. After that, Syax caught her. He's a member of Organization 13. Syax, got it memorized? Now go save her! Leave us alone! I think I liked it better when they were on my side. Feeling a little regret? Nah, I can handle these punks. <laughs> Watch this. You're... fading away. Well... That's what happens when you put your whole being into an attack. You know what I mean? Not that nobody's actually have beings, right? Anyway, I digress. Go. Find Kairi. Oh. Almost forgot. Sorry for what I did to her. When we find her... You can tell her that yourself. Think I'll pass. My heart just wouldn't be in it, you know? I haven't got one. <laughs> Axel, what were you trying to do? I wanted to see Roxas. He... was the only one I liked. He made me feel... like I had a heart. It's kind of... Funny. You make me feel the same. Kyrie's in the castle dungeon. Now go. Axel. This leads to. The house is looking pretty empty, huh? I thought I'd get a little enjoyment watching Axel throw one last tantrum. But he went a lot quieter than I thought. Perhaps he was ready for it. Perhaps he put his existence on the line and won what he'd been longing for. Wait a minute! How would that even be possible? We don't exist, remember? What you're saying goes against the laws of nature. Then perhaps he bet his non-existence. Either way, he came out a winner. Oh, Axel. A grifter till the end. That's absurd. He won nothing and is nothing. He couldn't stand the emptiness of being without a heart, and that led to his demise. He was foolish and weak. But... weakness has the power to awaken that which is dormant. It is clear that through his actions, however foolish they may have been, Axel has touched Sora's heart. Perhaps he will soon awaken.
Castle said Kyrie's in the dungeon. Then we'd better find a way to get to that castle. why he picked you. Who's finally awake? <gasps> Axel! Or maybe I have it wrong. Might be time to sleep. Soon we won't be able to talk like this anymore. Does that mean it's time for me to go back to where I belong? You know, I've been thinking about something Namine said. Roxas, are you really sure that you don't have a heart? Is it possible that we all have one? You, me, her? Or is that just wishful thinking? I don't know. I can't just look inside. Yeah, I guess not. But I figure, if there is something in there, inside us, then we'd feel it, wouldn't we? And if so... No, never mind. Come on, don't leave me hanging. Sora will find the answer we're looking for. I know he will, because he's me. True enough. Uh, thanks. Man, I miss the old times. Still got it memorized. The day we met, when you got your new name, you and I sat right here and watched the sunset. Yeah. This place is home. Me, Hainer, Pence, Olette, we've shared a lot of adventures. You'll see them again. I know you will. Yeah, you're right. Well, I should go. 
Sora's waiting for me. Yeah, I suppose he is. Man, this is some good ice cream, huh? Take care, okay? Right back at you, buddy. I don't know. You just disappeared. Then me and Donald had to fight some nobodies. Oh. He said he defeated Riku. Who said that? That guy in the black coat. But nobody can defeat Riku. Y yeah, you're right. A black coat means Organization 13. He must have been trying to trick you. Yeah, that must be why we didn't see him. Huh? You must be tired, Sora. Come on, let's just find a way to get into that castle. Dead end? There's gotta be a path somewhere. going to do with us? You're the fire that feeds Sora's anger. No. Sora's in danger because of me. We're almost there. Kyrie, where are you? Shh, remember where we are. This is their stronghold. Wait, your majesty. Be careful. I think we got company. Nominee. There you are. 
Naminé? Kairi, I'm afraid leaving is not an option. I'll take you to see Sora. You don't want that? I do. More than anything. But not with you around. If I had a heart, this would be where I'd die of laughter. You... Didn't Roxas take care of you? You can take it from here, Riku. Riku? Sora, you've done well. Where's Kairi? Who knows? I expect she's catching up with her friend from the darkness. What do you mean? She doesn't need you anymore. I'm supposed to believe that? Well, you don't have to. But you can believe this. Organization 13 has no further use for you. Just look there. Our kingdom hearts. Thanks to you, we've collected countless hearts. Can you hear their euphoria? Now all they need is one more helping from the Keyblade Bearer. Kingdom Hearts! Sora! Sora, it's really you! Kairi! Huh? You leave Sora alone! Sora is completely hopeless without us. Come on, Riku. Well, well. Will the intrusions never end? <laughs> Why, Pete? This castle is perfect. Perhaps we should uh, acquire it. Well, the setup is kind of nice, I guess. But what about all the heartless? Oh, this in-between world, it, it's way too close to the darkness. They ain't gonna listen to us here. Once again, you underestimate me, 